In this video, I want to show you the things that we got Ashley for Christmas. Ashley's 20 years old, so Ashley has uh, more adult gifts this year. Uh, a lot of the things Ashley either requested or she chose herself. I mean, we went shopping and she was with us and she um, said uh, that would be nice for Christmas and I said, well, let me get it for you and as long as you're okay with me putting it back, then um, I will buy it for you for Christmas, but I have to be able to put it back. So she agreed to that. And uh, so, for example, the first thing I wanna show you is and this is called, it's Maddie M is the brand, and it's called the Car Coat. And it is a very long, let's see if I can back up here and back up and show it to you. It is a very long coat. See how long it is? And I love the color. This will go with anything. This uh, dark red it's it's more of a maroon and it has black it's plaid it's very very thick very warm and I there is not a price on it I will I can tell you some pri prices of some things but in most cases I will not be able to give prices because I did not write anything down so we bought her this car coat and then Ashley requested, this is a personal item, and I can give you the price of this just because I left the receipt in the bag. This is a personal item. So, um, these, we bought her one, two, three, five pairs of panties, and they were $29.50. So, almost $30. But, I want, uh, the reason I'm showing you these is because these are very practical panties. I like these myself. If you are a lady who wears uh, nice dresses or dress pants, then you don't like the seam uh, to show on your, on your leg, or um, even if you're wearing a dress and maybe it doesn't have a belt, then you don't want that band to show around your waist. These are the perfect panty. These are from Victoria's Secret. And as you can see, they have no band at the top and they have no band around the side. They are seamless. And that might be, they're called, these are hip huggers. They are just um, hip, hip hugger hipster is what they're called. And so we bought her, I bought, it looks like I bought two. I didn't know what, what colors to get, and they don't come in a lot of colors, and, and it would defeat the purpose to get bright red or pink or something like that. I tried to get colors, you know, that would uh, blend in with anything. So it looks like I bought two of the um, flesh color, is what I would call them, which I think go with everything. And then I bought a pair of black and a pair of white and a pair of gray and i have worn these as well uh, with dresses and that's what i like to wear now with dresses uh, because you do not see any seam at all so that's it for clothes for now unless i add more at the end of this video ashley requested a heated blanket so this is the sunbeam heated blanket we bought this at walmart and they come in various degrees of softness. They have soft, extra soft, ultra soft, and premium soft. I didn't even see any of the premiums, premium soft, but this is ultra soft, and it is very, it, it feels like um, a really nice stuffed animal is, is how it feels. And all of Ashley's bedding is a silver color. So this gray is the perfect color for her. And this is a queen size. And I did notice that, of course, the bigger the size, the more expensive it is. So, so this was not cheap. But she also wanted one that would go off 
um, after she was thinking they went off after like eight hours this one goes off after 10 hours so I think that is a wonderful wonderful feature because you know she might get up in a rush in the morning and forget to turn it off and that way it will go off after 10 hours and there are dual controls because this is for a queen-size bed so you have one for each side of the bed then, Ashley, I have uh, from when my, my mom bought me a book. It's a blank recipe book, and I think it's called, it, the front says, like, I'm writing my own recipe book, something like that. And I have a lot of recipes in it. I also have out of magazines where I would see um, pictures of cakes or recipes. I would cut those out and I have those taped inside. Uh, but Ashley requested one of those books as well. She, uh, she really likes this and this one is actually bound better than the one that I have. The one that I have is honestly, it's falling apart and it's just because of the way it's made. Um, but this is uh it's called recipes a cooking journal and it says write it down and i bought this from amazon they had a lot to choose from and on the inside this is just an example it shows it shows the it says recipe four and then you would put like uh, tuna casserole and then perfect for serving with which mine doesn't have that so you might put corn and the date and who it's from who the recipe's from so I might have gotten that from mom and the prep time uh, servings nutritional information they're a lot more technical in this book than I've ever been um, ingredients hard to find ingredients and the directions and then notes for freezing reheating etc and then excellent good fare and never again you can actually put never again i uh, like to try the recipes out before i commit to putting them in my book so i might put a recipe a new recipe on just a scrap sheet of paper and if it works out if i think oh i'll make that again then i'll put it in my recipe book but if it was a one-time thing recently i've made several one-time things um it's like no that's not good enough to put in the recipe book so it gets thrown away <laughs> so but there's that and then we bought her a lot of uh, tools, kitchen tools, that uh, she, she picked out two, we picked out the rest. She picked out this stainless steel knife, and we have one of these as well, and she really likes to use that, and it was $9.99, probably, I think we bought that at Tuesday morning, I want to say, and then she picked this out. These are tongs, and these were $5.99, and they might have been from Tuesday morning as well. Now, Kevin and I picked these out. This is a cherry wood spoon spatula. This is a KitchenAid brand, and you can see this is Ashley's, this is the color that she really, really likes. These are all-purpose kitchen shears, and they come with a cover, but... Um, we, we never use covers on ours. These are, uh, this is a utility whisk. And it's a smaller size. And then we have a cookie scoop. Everyone needs a nice cookie scoop. I didn't know that until I was much older. I wish I had known that when I was young, though. Um, Ashley knows that, so that's good. Ashley picked these out. These are the Pioneer Woman measuring cups. And they're just... The colors are so cute. I want to try to get... Here we go. There's a lot of... Uh, it would be helpful if I could open this, but I don't want to open it. There is a picture on the top. And those... I wish you could see... The detail on them better but these were actually bought at walmart walmart has the whole line of pioneer woman uh dishes i don't know if anyone sells pioneer woman or not or if they have pioneer woman exclusively ashley picked this out this is a uh, a bin 
actually to put in your refrigerator. However, Ashley plans on putting uh, makeup supplies in it. This was bought at home, the at home store, and it was $12.99. So not cheap for a little bin like this, but I think she'll have it for a long time. And then we bought her this uh, at uh, Bed Bath & Beyond. This is the non-stick oven liner. And Kevin and I have one of these. I think they're about $20. But let me tell you something. They are worth it. They are so worth it. We cook pizzas all the time. And there's always mozzarella or cheese falling to the bottom of the um, oven. With this, it falls on this. All you do is let your oven cool off and all that, that cheese or whatever will turn black and all you do is wipe it off. I mean, I put it in the sink. Sometimes it's really dirty. So I'll put it in the sink with soap and water and wash it off and put it right back in the oven. It's fantastic rather than scrubbing your oven. I wish that's one of those things I wish I had known about a long time ago as well when I was, when I was young. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm trying to reach. Ashley requested this. This is a uh, spice organizer. It was bought at Home Goods. It was $14.99. And you can see it's it's for spices and it shows different size um, jars on there. So I'm hoping that uh, that actually works, <laughs> that it works for all sizes. This is another thing that Ashley requested. This is from Target. We actually went online and bought it and then we saw it in the store. So we could have gotten it at the store, but we weren't sure. So we went ahead and bought it online. I don't remember how much it was. This is a kitchen rug. Uh, this is a rug that you would put uh, under your sink and uh, then you would stand on it while you do your dishes and give yourself a little cushion. Okay, and we bought her this KitchenAid. This is the uh, food chopper. It has uh, two speeds. It says it's 3.5 cups. And once again, it is her color. They are calling it uh, ice blue. So when I go to look for things, I look for this, um, that ice blue color. And then I have a big box to show you. Um, we also bought her this KitchenAid. This is the ice blue. Let's see, let me scoot you back just a little bit. This is the ice blue um, KitchenAid mixer. Uh, Kevin has one of these in the red. I'm sure you all have seen it uh, during uh, recipe videos. Uh, we absolutely love it. And Kevin, you know, we were much much older Kevin hasn't even had his very long uh, before we got one because these are expensive they're very very expensive machines however I think she will have this for a long long time they last a long time so it's an investment when you when you spend the money on these things you're just uh, you're investing it so I'm glad that we were able to to find uh, this color for her and pick this up for her. It's a very nice machine. Um, now, something that I don't have right here in uh, front of you is um, Ashley once, um, she had requested a television for Christmas, but she changed her mind. She said she would rather have the money. And um, so she, uh, she also requested the, the electric blanket after that. And she said, please take uh, the electric blanket money out of my TV money. So, long story short, we are going to give her $250 cash. Instead of buying her a television, uh, we bought her the, uh, the electric blanket, which was about uh, almost $100, I think. And um, we'll give her $250 cash. So, this may be it for Ashley. Uh, if it is, I hope you enjoyed the video, and if we buy anything else, of course, I will add on to it, and so thanks for watching.